good morning happy friday yay super excited it's friday um i'm gonna go ahead and do a get ready with me today video using senogen's products um so if you're interested in ordering after this video let me know um, i've got all kinds of good stuff here that you can use as a multi-purpose so let's go ahead and get started um, the first thing I'm going to do is cover up all of my blemishes and my under eye bags um, with candlelight shadow scents. Yes, this is an eyeshadow, but yes, you can actually use it as a highlighter, um, like a concealer, under eye, obviously. So, yeah, let's go ahead and start. Hold on. Turn the video. Hi, bye. So sorry guys, that was my husband and I don't think he realized I was doing a video. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and take a breath in. We're gonna go ahead and take the sponge and blend. So, I already look more awake, and obviously feel more awake because I am using makeup, and I feel like that always makes me up. So, um, look a little bit better. Nice. Uh, we're going to go ahead next and use what we have as Make Sense Foundation in the shade of Almond, um, and we're going to go ahead and just, we don't even need that much, just a little bit all over. all the way out that we're getting under our chin getting all in our nose under our eyebrows making sure we don't have any streaks and lines thing about this foundation is it actually um, can blend up with three different skin pigmentation tones. Um, so if someone is a little bit similar to me, but say has a little more olive tone or has more red spots um, or something like that, it can help blend. And it actually blends to your skin type, so it's um, pretty cool. I think it's really awesome. And it stays on all day. All of the Senegens products do last um, all day through sweat, food, water. It's amazing. Okay, let's go ahead and move on here. Oh, let me cover this up. Okay, awesome. So let's go ahead and move on. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and use do my brows next. Um, I use a little makeup palette with a brown color and this little eyeliner brush. You know it says eyeliner, but it really helps with filling in my brows. Helps me square them off on the end.
So that's what it looks like right now. Okay, got the brows, what they call it, on fleek. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to go ahead and move on. We're going to do a little bit of a smoky eye today. Um, so back with the candlelight as our base color. So that's our base there. Now I'm going to move on with Amethyst Shadow Sense. It is purple and I really, really like it a lot. So I'm going to go ahead and start right in the middle right here. Go all the way out. Take my shadow brush and just blend. This part is this, you guys, you really don't need a lot of this. It lasts for so long. Okay. That's what our eyes look like right now. And then I have Onyx that I'm going to finish up here with. And just go right on the outside of my eye. Just blend on the outside. This part is, guys, as you guys, you can blend it with your fingers, too. Um, it's a cream to powder shop scent, so that's pretty cool. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and blend that a little more. You can definitely tell that I used way too much. I'm going to go ahead and cover the top here. That. What I love is candlelight shadow sense is pretty much good for everything. For, you know, covering up errors as a concealer, as we talked about. Um if you mess up on your eyes, you can go back and kind of cover it over. It's entirely up to you. Just a little bit more over here. So I definitely go through this one a little bit faster than most other colors because I do use it so much more often for other things, even if I'm not wearing eyeshadow. Okay, so. That's what my eyes look like. Um, we're going to move on next to using the Lash Extend. It is just an eyelash um, extender growth. So it comes in a little brush like this, and you just go ahead and put it on like normal mascara. It definitely has really helped my eyelashes grow, I can definitely tell. Alright, so we got that going on now. We're going to move on to blush scents. 
Um, this is the newest color they recently launched. It's called Pink Berry. Super cute. You really only need a little bit. So just go ahead and you just dab it on the cheeks. I like to put mine up a little higher. Go ahead and use a makeup brush. Actually, no, we're going to use a makeup, makeup sponge, I should say. And we're just going to blend it. Blush ends can actually be used um, on your eyes too, I believe. I'm not sure if it can be used on your lips. I'm pretty sure it can, but I have never tried that yet, so. Okay, so there's my blush nice and blended in. I used to hate wearing blush, but I really like it now. I really feel like it brightens up my eyes. Okay, so now we're going to move on to lip scents. Yay! Um, I'm going to go ahead and use Sassy Z today. So you go ahead and shake it up for a good 30 seconds. So you're going to take a little bit and scrape it off so you have the thinnest layer possible. And you're just going to apply it one way. Don't apply back and forth. Make sure you keep your lips open and you're going to let it dry and then you're going to do it the same time or the same again twice. So. I'm going to use my Ojo Gloss today. And that is my look of the day a little bit glam but that's okay because I like glam looks so this is my full face here it is not going to come off throughout the day it is sweat proof waterproof food proof kiss proof um, all of the above so um, if you guys are interested in getting this look just let me know I posted it in the comments below uh, anyways I hope you guys have a wonderful day and let me know if you have any questions okay